Hello, welcome to another video tutorial from ComputerGarGuard.com. This tutorial will look at how to hide summary tasks in Microsoft Project. I've got a project open in Project 2010 on screen at the moment, and I have resources assigned to them tasks within my project. And I'm often asked if if we want to perform filters for resources to try and create a kind of who does what and when scenario in Gantt chart view uh, for either printing or exporting into email or something like that then you know we, we only need to see the tasks that that resource is doing we don't need to see the the names of the phases or these kind of you know this outline so you know relatively common question for me to be asked how do I hide them summary tasks how can I remove them temporarily for this export or for this this print of some kind so first of all let's look at performing that filter I'm gonna to pop to my resource names filter arrow here and I'm gonna filter the list to only see the tasks that Donald Duck is involved in and I'm gonna click OK so I have Donald's tasks he he only has three tasks it's got one in the planning phase, one in the development phase, and one in the rollout. Uh, unfortunately, he's got the right manual task. Never a good task. Um, not, not my favourite job. But this isn't maybe the best way of viewing it. You may be happy with that, but you know, there's more summary tasks there than there are the actual tasks. And planning isn't actually actually a task. We're more concerned with the task that we want. To hide them. Very easy, Project 2010, I'll click the Format tab under Gantt Chart Tools at the top and I'm going to untick the Summary Tasks button that appears on the far right. That will hide them tasks, you know this list can now be easily exported or printed as it is, you know I may decide to hide this resource names column or just kind of sneak it behind my uh, you know my divider pane now and I have what I want for my export when all is said and done we can bring them back you know tick my summary tasks whip that back to the right and remove my filter and there are many ways around this I'm not saying this is the quickest way but as a method of hiding summary tasks we'll find that checkbox on the format tab and some of the main reasons for that is when you're performing filters on columns like resource names um, and we don't want these kind of summary tasks cluttering up, uh, cluttering up our export. Thank you for watching, hope you find this tutorial useful, please check out some of the other tutorials that you will find at computergargart.com